It was a system where if a ward wanted a terminal clean or an environmental clean, they had to ring the bed managers. The de bed managers then had to ring or bleep one of my supervisors and then the supervisors had to get hold of the decant team and pass on the message. So often there were long delays and then we'd get angry phone calls, why hasn't this room been done? Rooms were done out of priority and once started you had to finish the room and you could need an agent room that hadn't got on the system uh, too because HGU and ITU are priority one and it just caused delays, miscommunications etc to my staff, to nursing staff, bed managers and that in the long term caused problems to admissions for patients. I have always found the open ward very easy to use. I have to say, when I was told about it, I was very sceptical. I thought the staff wouldn't be able to use it, they wouldn't follow through and things, but it has saved us time tremendous and I wouldn't go back to the old system at all now. We find it easier to read, it's not a lot of paper, it's not a lot of phone calls, it's not a lot of bleeping. It's a very easy system altogether. As a department, we use Open Ward on a daily basis, uh, probably 20 hours a day, whereby if a ward wants a terminal clean or an environmental clean, they click it onto the board, we pick that up on our computers or at any board across the unit. My supervisors check as they walk around the unit, they don't have to keep ringing back. It's there, they can click onto any system. Um, initially, it comes up as red, then when we've seen it and we've done something, we've sent a message to our staff, we change it to yellow. Then when the clean has been finished, my staff come onto the board and change it to green completed. Therefore, at a glance, the site matrons can know what rooms are available, what stage they're at. They can see if a room's been, been put on the board and we've not responded to it because it's still at red and we can change it accordingly.